DC heroes are pretty cool. But what if they were in Minecraft? So today, I'm going to remake every mob into DC heroes. <laughs> Well, here we go again. So the first DC hero we'll make is the Flash. All right, Flash, we need to get the right skin tone on you. But we also do need to give him his red suit. So the Flash suit doesn't really show him his eyes, so we'll just go ahead and make his mask. And then we'll color it in with white. Let's color in this yellow piece, yellow. I'm gonna add this little cube right here. And we're gonna give him his ear lightning bolts. He has this thing that like wraps around his arms. Give him his belt. Let's make this white little patch on his chest. His oh so very iconic lightning bolt on his chest. So far, I'd say this is pretty good. However, with the power of Photoshop, boom, he is now textured. The Flash is looking great. Let's go see how he looks like in Minecraft, though. Here we go. It's time to see the speedster himself. And whoa, look at him. He looks sick. It's the Flash. Ah, oh, he looks great. Just look at him move. I mean, he's not running as fast as he could be, but everything turned out well. Now, I'm curious, though. These zombies are slow. How However, we can make him really fast if we just turn him into a little child. Oh my gosh. That <laughs> doesn't have his mask on. So it's just a little naked face. I didn't add any texture. Oh no. Why did none of y'all have your mask on? I guess it's fine since you do grow up to have your mask on. However, I do want to see the full potential of these flash zombie babies. Go into survival and hello. Oh my gosh, look at those speedy legs. Look at the wheels on those boys. There's also just a big horde of flashes just chasing me. This isn't terrifying to look at. Oh, I died. There we have the flash. Up next, we have the iron golem and we're going to turn the iron golem into superman i'm sorry i have to do this to you but good time goodbye your schnoz no need to have these super long arms let's also adjust the body a little bit he ain't that thick you have to scrunch your head though now that we have the body structure let's go ahead and fill him in fill in his costume you know what let's go ahead and make it a little bit derpy and put his eyes right there let's give him that little hair curl right here <laughs> let's give him some mean eyebrows yep this is definitely it so we have some super red speedos right here i just made superman speedos we need to fill in his arms he does need however his belt and now we need to fill in his big old chest because the one in only iconic superman logo but just as iconic as the logo his extremely over the top superman cape and with the finishing touches our man of steel is done this is quite ironic that we're making the man of steel with iron blocks but three two one boom superman wow you look absolutely derpy but honestly i think in a good way i mean you got your logo you got your cape <laughs> you got your speedo and the best thing apart you is let me just do this real quick you can even fly uh you were supposed to fly. Now, this might be weird, but let's have Superman versus the Flash. Oh my gosh, Flash, you gotta run. It wasn't fast enough. Okay, well, how about we add more Flashes? Flash, you're better off just running away. I don't know why you're even trying. Oh, <gasps> Superman, the Man of Steel is cracking. He doesn't bleed, he cracks. Wait, this actually might be a close fight. Hold up. Who's he gonna win? Oh, stop. I think Superman did it. Oh, he, oh, of course, he wins again. Psych, I'm the winner. We have to keep doing this. Superman, where are you? Ha, I found you. I'm about to hit you with the two time. I'll make you crack. I don't need kryptonite. I do need kryptonite. Do I really have to tell you who I'm about to turn this bat into? First one I'm gonna need to do, buff him up a little bit. Color in his face. Color the whole body a bit gray. And we're actually not gonna need these ears, so I'm gonna go ahead and just get rid of them. Let's now make his bat mask. Okay, so far so good. Let's give him his white eyes. Now we can't miss this part of his mask. Then his bat ears. Oh, okay, now that the head's done, let's go ahead and work on this body. And first things first, he needs legs. Okay, shoes done. Now there's something missing here. That's right, another yellow belt. Now I'm just kidding, I'll give him his arms. Now that we have his arms, let's finish the rest of the coloring here. Speedo's done. Now for his gloves. Oh, and we need his cape. Oh, the bat wings. But finally, let's make this oval shape and let's carve out the bat symbol. That's a pretty solid bat symbol if I do say so myself. And for the finishing touches, we've made the shadows. Vengeance. We've made Batman. Oh, it's so cool. Okay, I want to see it in Minecraft. We need to go into a bat cave. <gasps> Oh my gosh, look at him. This is so amazing. I love this. He's so tiny. Let me have more. I want to make more. Oh, this looks amazing. Yeah, this is a huge step up from the last time I made a bat. All the animations work perfectly. His wings be flapping. I want to see a bat upside down. <gasps> He's just... Oh, Batman overload. No, they're burning themselves. Batman, no. Please stop. No, they're all turning on fire. Oh, no. It wasn't supposed to be like this. They weren't supposed to fly through the lava. Batman, you're the greatest detective. You're not supposed to be running through the lava. Oh, my gosh. I got him. Look at Batman <laughs> sitting like that. Y'all can just chill there. That's fine. The others are just kind of going rampant. Oh, uh, look at him. He's just big chilling right now. Hey, Flash, good news. The Batman is really tiny. You might be able to beat him up. Uh, we have most of the gang here. Batman's flashes. Well, we did have a flash. 
Superman. I mean, come on. In all seriousness, though, this turned out absolutely amazing, and I'm really happy with how it turned out. Next mob. Oh, this one's gonna be funny. I'm gonna turn this axolotl into Aquaman. So the live-action Aquaman actually has really long hair, so these gills kind of work for, like, his luscious set of hair. We need to give him his macho beard, yellow eyes, his skin. Now for his bright orange suit. Aquaman doesn't have a tail or fin thing. What he does have is green pants, though. Let's give him his green feet, color his hands green, and then the rest orange. But shocker, I need to give him a yellow belt. What is up with DC heroes always having yellow belts? This is so bad. Uh, I don't really know where the Axolotl could really hold the Triton, but, but honestly, there's only one place I could really think of to put it, and that's to kind of just lay it on his back. Yeah, I would say this is good enough. And there we have it. Aquaman. Aquaman, here we go. Oh my gosh, look at him. Oh, he's running towards the water. Here, Aquaman, I'll give you a little push. There you go. Oh, now he's zooming. Oh, <gasps> witnessing a murder. Oh no, we just witnessed him a murder. Oh, now he's coming towards me. By the way, I'm well aware that I could have just used a drown to make Aquaman because they come with tridents. But I mean, come on, this is way too funny. Like, look at all of them just hunting on the squid, dude. That's so unfair. But now we need to see the baby. The baby Lotto, look at him. Or I mean, uh, baby Aquaman. Yeah. Come on, kitty, let's have a ton of them. Oh yes, with the babies. Oh, uh, they're swarming. They're about to commit a whole genocide on these squids. All right, now splash. <laughs> oh, he's looking straight up at me. You didn't like that, did you? Whoa, Aquaman, done. Uh, this one's gonna be a bit interesting. I'm somehow gonna have to turn this weather into Cyborg. He definitely doesn't need his rib cage right here. Cyborg's pretty huge, so let's go ahead and give him a little bit more girth. Let's give him some little nubby legs here. Let's uh, make his one good eye. Give him some hair. So what I wanna do now is actually work on his Cyborg part of his face. Something like this. Let's give him his one red beady eye. Give him his big old chest plate here. Work on his feet. Put his red core right here. Now the reason why I wanna turn the wither into Cyborg is because I wanna turn the other heads into like blaster cannons. Oh, he looks so cursed. All right, that's it. Cyborg's done. This looks awful. Oh, I'm worried about this. Ugh. Oh, oh, he doesn't have his mask. Okay, there we go. We fixed it. Hey, don't, not the pig. Cyborg, not the pig. Quit it. No, I will avenge you. Oh, he's like shimming in his little cannons right there. Oh my gosh. The pig didn't deserve that. Okay, let's try again. Cyborg, for the most part, he doesn't look that bad. Doesn't really make sense. Oh my gosh, he's attacking the little chicken. Oh no. <gasps> okay, you know what? You should not be a thing. Go away. There we have Cyborg. For the next hero, I'm gonna turn the creeper into Shazam. Let's move his feet back. We're also gonna need to give him some arms, of course. When you give him arms, he kind of looks like a short little stubby character. Let's color him properly. Let's give him his eyes right here. Color in his hair. Wow, he has a huge forehead. Now, we do need to give him his bright red outfit. And now he has like these like yellow sleeves kind of on him. Uh, shocker, of course. He also needs his yellow belt. We need to add his superhero cape. Now, it's kind of interesting. The flesh has a lightning bolt on his chest, but so does Shazam. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh, this is Shazam. So the reason why I use a creeper for Shazam is because with this command, we'll get a supercharged creeper, which kind of looks like lightning, and that's what Shazam is. This was, oh, your it has the creeper. Oh, this is so broken. Oh, no. But I mean, you still got the electrical current on you. I think that looks cool. But we spawn in a couple more right here. Ah, uh, yes. Little broken-footed Shazams. Also, be sure to subscribe as we're trying to beat Kids Playtime TV to 1 million subscribers. So subscribe right now to help us beat them. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. Here's today's fan art. If you guys want to download these custom mobs, then be sure to join the Discord. And also follow my Twitch.